Hi, I'm Dr. Adam Fields. Welcome back to your freed up shoulders. We're going to start with the subscapularis muscle. Go ahead and take that thumb, put it under your armpit, grab around and squeeze. Squeeze it. You're going to feel some pain. This is a great place to start because once you free up that subscapularis, your shoulder is going to have more range of motion. This video is going to bring you a little bit more into fuller ranges of motion. As I was saying, your shoulder needs some lubrication. We are going to give it to you today. Are you excited? Are you excited to be alive? You should be because you're doing what you need to be doing right now. This is it. You've arrived exactly where you need to be in your day. Good job. So just squeeze it. Squeeze it and knead it. It's like you're squeezing out an old tube of toothpaste or something. Just squeezing it out getting any interstitial fluid in between the cells and those muscles. Squeeze it, squeeze it, squeeze it. Okay, so now it's a little freed up. Feel it dangle a little bit. We're gonna do knocking on the door of life again. Your knees are slightly bent, they're supple, and we're gonna start rotating. Rotating. With this video, I want you to go a little higher than you did in the first video. Let those hands hit your kidneys, even up to your chest, even hit your shoulder. Let's get your shoulders moving a little bit. That's it. Whip them. Whip them. Whip them. Great. Your shoulders are not being used at all. They're just moving. They're completely passive. Good job. I like this one. It's fun. It's massaging your whole body, really. Engage those abs. Don't let them up. Let those knees bend. Keep them supple. Get in a rhythm. Just lose yourself in it. Close your eyes if you have to. Okay, let's take that arm that needs more movement and let's get it moving. Let's go up and back like this. Up and back. Up and back. Just like that. Good. There you go. Good. At the downstroke, you really want to push it down and feel the gravity. Feel the G-force. It's like a Porsche 911 around the turn. Boom. There you go. Let's get both hands involved. Like this. Be playful with it. Feel it. There you go. Now we're going to get a little different angle. We're going to go bent over. Go fat, so fast you hear the wind come off your arms. Feel the scapula even. Get the back of your ribs. Feel them let go. Feel them let go. Good. Now we're going to go like an elephant's trunk and we're going to go side to side. Sweep them from side to side. Feel them move. This is meant to be done in conjunction with care in our office where we do shockwave therapy, we do mobilization of the shoulder, we give more, even more specific exercises for your situ situation. If you can, feel the chest open up a little bit, like that, like that. Okay, we're going to flap your wings now. I, don't want, I want you to bend at the hips, not at the back. Don't round the back. Arch the back, come forward, and here we go. And one downstroke, put your left arm in front, and the other downstroke, put your right arm in front. I think I can, I think I can. <laughs> like a duck flapping its wings here. Okay. Open that chest. Open it. Now, if, you, if this is hurting, just go subtle. This right here. This is good enough for you. Be happy with it. It's a victory today. Good. But if you can, open it up. I don't want pain. Soreness is fine. No pain. 
Okay, let's move it up top. If you want, you may do a split stance on this. You come forward, back, forward. There you go. Move in the body. Try and use your arm force as much as possible. Use your core and your legs to get this accomplished. Really open it up. Feel this force all the way to the tip of your fingers. Good. Let's do some shoulder rolls now. And just roll. Good. Get full range of motion. Feel your scapula. Open the hands a little bit. Good. Mobility is king right now. Every cog in the wheel of your shoulder, your scapula, your ribs, your humerus, clavicle, your neck even, even your diaphragm, your low back, you want mobility on this one. Do some foam rolling. Let's go the other direction, back to front. Beautiful. Bring that chest up. Really use your whole body. That's it. Good job. Okay, now we're going to go arms out like this, totally straight. And we're going to pronate. And we're going to supinate. Good. Pronate, supinate. Let's get the fingers wide when we do it. Pronate, supinate. When you supinate, I want you to Bring the chest up and pull the shoulders down. When you pronate, shoulders forward, round out the thoracic spine. Chest is up, round out the thoracic spine. Keep going. Chest is up. It's almost like a cat camel. Feel that scapula is just gliding over your ribs, creating movement. Good, get a good 10 more in. Chest is up, Superman, boom. Curl forward, chest is up, proud posture, forward. There we go, good. Get that energy going, keep it going. Okay, let's shake it out. Good job, shake it out, use your knees. Let those shoulders hang like slinkies. Okay, we're going to do a little strengthening. We're going to get the back of the shoulders strong. But this is not a strengthening video. It's a loosening video. 90 degrees with your arms. Chest is up. Pinch the shoulder blades together. Bring them together in the front. Pinch them together in the front. When, when you bring them in the, in the front, push your forearms, push your hands together, and then pinch your shoulder blades together. Just like this. Good. And as your shoulders get more mobile, you'll be able to come all the way up here. And that's really what we want. More mobility. Pinch it, squeeze it. Pinch it, squeeze it. Okay, we're going to do a little stretching. Now, some of you, in fact a lot of you, are going to have to use maybe a shirt or a little piece of rope or whatnot and, and grab it in the back. Okay, right now what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab my hands like this, but I understand that some of you won't be able to do that. Okay, so you may just hold on to something. So let's go ahead and grab if you can or hold on to something to keep your arms a little bit further apart. Straighten the arms. Pull the shoulders down, keep the palms together if you're at this level, and now we're going to stretch forward. We're going to stretch forward, we're going to get a nice long stretch. Keep the low back arched and lift those arms as much as you can. You might be here, you might be here, don't worry about that. Just go to your level.
come on up. Good. Good job. Shake him out a little bit. And let's do a little cross the body. Let's do it with both. And just big breath in. Feel that outer deltoid stretch. Good. And twist your body a little bit. And let's go to the other side and twist the other side out. Way to show up for your free shoulders. Keep it up.